figure skating is a fairly conservative sport. In competitive programs, athletes avoid experiments, choosing proven ways to please the judges. However, in ice shows, figure skaters can afford everything. Experiments, which they diligently avoid at tournaments, result in something fiery and burning in demonstration performances. Revealing costumes, outrageous antics and passionate numbers become the nails of any ice show. We recall the sexiest demonstration performances of figure skaters, which are impossible to forget. The most famous number of Elizabeth Tiktamasheva is still her bright undressing to the song Toxic by Britney Spears. The world saw this program for the first time at a gala show after the Grand Prix stage in Canada in October 2018. Lisa then took the gold and felt like the hostess of the party as never before. The figure skater took to the ice in an easily recognizable flight attendant costume, holding treats on a tray, but from the first musical notes it became clear that she did not intend to be modest. And Lisa did not disappoint, she amazed everyone with incredibly bold and liberated dances. She dropped her cap, let her hair down, and during the cantilever she effectively unbuttoned her jacket and remained in a black lace bra. The audience was completely delighted with the daring act of the athlete. But there was also a lot of criticism on Lisa, someone found her toxic unacceptably frank. The troublemaker herself explained the idea of undressing with the desire to return men to figure skating. And I didn't he lose, they appreciated her stewardess. And she also inspired skaters around the world to arrange a kind of challenge with undressing on skates, girls posted videos marked number to tick on social networks and expressed their admiration for Lisa. Our dance duo Alexander Stepanov and Ivan Bukin also distinguished themselves with an insanely sensual program. Having become vice champions of Europe in 2019, the figure skaters skated at demonstration performances to the poems of Boris Pasternak performed by Alla Pugacheva. The number, for all its tenderness and lyricism, was imbued with passion. However, many people remember not the production itself, but Stepanova's costume, a tight black jumpsuit made of translucent fabric. The girl's body seemed to be completely covered, but in fact the costume showed off her magnificent figure as much as possible. On this occasion, Sasha was even written about on the website of the men's magazine Maxim. His staff regretted that they did not watch the entire European Championship. On the one hand, it's a jumpsuit, yes. You can't argue with that. But the jumpsuit is the kind that will give odds to some bickiness. It is maximally tight and minimally dense, actually transparent. We are sure that it is this jumpsuit that will make yesterday's hockey fans devoted figure skating fans, commented Stepanova's outfit on the Maxim website. Not only girls are able to impress with their sexuality at ice shows. Yevgeny Plushenko once became famous for an outrageous number to the Tom Jones song Sex Bomb. The premiere took place in Vancouver at the 2001 World Championships when Plushenko won gold, beating his main rival Alexei Yagudin. It is impossible to forget their legendary confrontation, but still Eugene's game overshadows him with his superimposed muscles. From the very beginning of the performance under Sex Bomb, the skater flirted with the audience, gradually throwing off the details of clothing. First, I got rid of the jacket, showing the embossed false muscles, and in the end I pulled off my trousers and continued to write in a body leotard and cheerful golden underpants. At the same time, the complex costume that turned the athlete into a bodybuilder did not prevent him from jumping as well, naturally, Plushenko basked in the well-deserved ovation of the audience. Evgenia Medvedeva discovered her sexuality long before the famous photo shoot in Maxim. Having won bronze at the World Championships in Satama, the girl went to perform in various ice shows and surprised in South Korea in a very bold glamorous way. She appeared on the ice in a top, mini skirt and stockings made of pink latex and coquettishly threw a white faux fur coat on top, which she threw off with pleasure during the program. Medvedeva skated to Ariana Grande's hit Seven Rings and her costume actually repeated the image of the singer in the video. But it didn't matter to the fans, the main thing was that Genya allowed herself to fool around properly after a difficult season. Not everyone was delighted with the new number of the figure skater, someone tried to accuse her of vulgarity. But Genya did not pay attention to criticism, 
True fans really liked her glamour and latex. The Italian dance couple Barbara Fuser Poli and Maurizio Margallo have always enjoyed the audience's love. And how else, because they lit on ice and did not hesitate to excite ice passions. Especially in demonstration performances. So, in 2006, at the gala show of the Olympics in Turin, Barbara covered herself with a minimum amount of clothing. Under the composition Unchain My Heart, she skated in a yellow bra with rhinestones and a very short skirt with a long fringe, which fluttered with every movement. At the beginning of the program, she also played with a fluffy yellow boa, but then focused on hot dancing with a partner. Belgian Luna Hendricks is a worthy colleague of our Lisa Tiktamashiva in the return of men to figure skating. Luna is striking with her sexuality both at competitions and at shows, but in the latter case she tries especially hard. In addition, in the subdued light, the European beauty does not leave the slightest chance to tear the eyes of the fans away from her. This season, the moon delighted in the ice shows with a stunning fiery number under Circus Britney Spears, Hello Lisa. What can I say, you need to look at the number, words are superfluous here. What is only one outfit of a figure skater worth, a kind of hybrid of a swimsuit and a shortened tuxedo? Of course, it is made of black fabric, and red rhinestones are used as decorations in it. Luna could go out on the ice and just stand there, and it would still be very sexy. In terms of the amount of fire and passion on the ice, the Belgian is surpassed only by the incomparable Tiktamashiva.